Are you tired of the IT system admin asking that dreaded question, what do you see? What's on your screen? Well, in this demonstration, here's a laptop, and it's a new 2010 Intel Core i5 V Pro processor with Intel HD graphics and an Intel solid state drive. And this machine could be anywhere. It could be in a remote office in San Jose, Bangalore. It really doesn't matter, but it's a remote machine. And I'm on an IT system admin console. And what I can do is I can, with this new technology called KVM Remote Control, I can actually connect to this machine, see what the user sees, and not have to ask that question. Now, part of this is that the user has to give me consent to do this. They have to give me a six-digit code that I have to plug in into my console. And it looks like their code is 946440. And now I'm looking exactly at what they are. This is a revolutionary item I just did right here. This is something I couldn't do before. And when you talk about software solutions, this is something that I would never be able to see with a software solution, KVM. And now I can see that, hey, they've got a blue screen. I know what the blue screen is, and I know what the air is. So I'm gonna go ahead and reset this machine, power it up, and put it into a mode where I can use my IT support toolkit to, to fix it. And it doesn't matter what your support toolkit is of your choice, Still, you can use whatever you have, jump right in there, and I can start fixing that machine. In the past, at this point, when I go from like a DAW, a BIOS screen boot up into Windows, I usually lose control. This is that new groundbreaking capability that I'm showing you right here, right now. And I'm able to do things, like I'm gonna set some control parameters and set some authorization that I need to do to give the right access so that I can fix this machine. And let's do that right now. Now I've also got the ability for me to put in all my credentials. So if I've got certain support credentials, certain IT admin access that I need to do to my shares and what have you for those tool sets, that's all what it's going through right now. Now in the data center, this has been a capability that we've had for years for servers. And usually it requires an add-in, um, a card or a capability, a device, an application per se, or a standalone box. I've got to do certain things to get access. We've taken that exact type of capability and put it into hardware. Now I'm gonna, I know kind of what the error was and I know where that virus is at. So I'm gonna go click right into it. And I'm gonna go ahead and scan for a virus. So what I'm doing now is I'm doing normal remediation. I think they have a virus. I see that they do. I'm gonna scan for it, um, remove it off their system and get them back in gear. Now, in the past, this again, this required a costly desk side visit. It would require me to go to their office, bring media, fix them, or have them come in. So if this machine's halfway around the world, that's gonna cost me a good amount of money to get to. So if you could reduce your desk side visits, if you could reduce the ability, the, the productivity loss that you're gonna have with that employee coming in, then that's smart ROI.